Carolina Insider is presented by Wells Fargo, official sponsor of Carolina Athletics. And brought to you by Coke Zero Sugar. Carolina Ford, built for the Carolinas, built Ford proud. Visit your Carolina Ford dealer today. And by Hardison and Cochran, dial 919 all fours for a free legal consultation. Well, what a week for Carolina. Hello again. Thanks for being with us on the Carolina Insider. My name's Jones Angel, and man, we have a busy show coming up. Chalk full of action. First, Carolina basketball, a lot of Tar Heel basketball. Three games at home, three victories this week. It started Monday with the rescheduled game against Virginia Tech. Tar Heels battled to a 78-68 win. You'll see highlights of that, plus hear comments from Coach Davis after that victory. Just two days later, the Tar Heels, a little sluggish, understandable. That was their third game in five days. Played Boston College, did not shoot well at all, and yet found a way to beat the Eagles by 11. You'll see some highlights from that victory and hear from Puff Johnson as well. Puff back healthy, working his way into the mix for the Tar Heels. Really can be, feels like a big factor here in the second half of conference play. Finally, what a day on Saturday. Holy smokes. Tar Heels play great, beat NC State by 20. They led by as many as 35 in the second half in that game. Roy Williams was honored at halftime. The 1982 team had several of its members here. Of course, one of the best teams in college basketball history. So you're going to see highlights of the win, plus some highlights of those special events as well, honoring Coach Williams and recognizing the 1982 championship squad. That in and of itself would be enough show, but women's basketball, a big road win at Duke earlier in the week. You'll see some of that and wrestling goes on the road and picks up a victory as well. It was a tight one, just one point over Virginia in Charlottesville. So a lot to do. Let's start with Monday night in the Smith Center, Carolina and Virginia Tech. Both Baycott and Love went to a different man and watched the Luma run right by. Down low to Black, he finds a cutting Baycott and he throws it down. Baycott has every field goal for Carolina. Carolina keeps possession. Baycott has it now. Long cross-court pass in the left corner to Black. His three-pointer is good. And now Virginia Tech has its first lead of the game. Manick will try a quick catch and shoot three, and he knocks it in from the top left. Davis drives to the left wing, pitches it in the corner to Leaky Black. Looks inside, instead goes over to Love. Long triple, good love from the left wing. Well, Lean's going to look at him and just say, okay, you made a tough one. In the left corner to Black. Back up the sideline, pass to Davis. Boy, there is so much traffic down low as Love has it with six on the shot clock. He's just going to try one of those Caleb triples and one of those Caleb drop-ins from a long way away for three. So all that arrow talk that we were having a few minutes ago, now the heels get the possession as Love uses a Baycott screen to get deep. Kick it left corner to Leaky Black for three. Davis to Love in the left sideline. Penetrates down the baseline, kicks it at right corner to Manic, strips the net on the three. Love with 10 on the shot clock to Manic top left. His long three. Good! Love. Hesitation at the left wing. Fires it on the glass. No, but Manic flies in and dunks it home. 3.50 to go. Love to the right wing, goes right corner to Manic. Quick trigger triple, yes! Love pitches over to Manic on the left wing. Cross court, right corner, Davis, three, yes! Yeah, I love that. The Tar Heels end up scoring points on 12 of their last 13 possessions and outpaced Virginia Tech 78-68. And I'm just so proud of them. I really believe that. You said it was up and down, and, you know, there were times defensively it looked like they were getting every kind of look on the offensive end. We were turning the ball over. We were missing so many layups around the basket. But we never got down on these, ourselves. I just I just felt like our togetherness was really good. And I'm just I'm so proud of – I'm so proud of them. You know, last week was hard. You know, we didn't play well. I mean, we didn't play well against good teams, and they played really well against us. And – to come back and to be able to play such a quality opponent in, in, in Virginia Tech and to be able to come out with the win, I'm so proud of them. Introducing 48 square centimeters of earning potential. Flawlessly designed, undeniably versatile, unlimited 2% cash back. 
This is the card built for real life. She's gonna be a drummer. Yeah, she is. That's gonna get loud. Right? The new Wells Fargo Active Cash Visa credit card. Unlimited 2% cash back on purchases. That's real life ready. Your life is more flexible and efficient than ever. And your energy is too. See how North Carolina's electric cooperatives are building a brighter future for the rural communities we serve at ncelectriccooperatives.com slash brighter. Unwavering loyalty and commitment. That's what it means to be true blue. To earn this level of trust, Ford builds trucks that help you work smarter, tougher, to help you tackle any adventure year after year. See your Carolina Ford dealer today and discover what True Blue means to you. Now get 0 for 60 plus 1,000 bonus cash on the 2021 Ford F-150. New inventory is arriving daily at your Carolina Ford dealer. I need to try it first. Yeah. Your life is more flexible and efficient than ever. And your energy is too. See how North Carolina's electric cooperatives are building a brighter future for the rural communities we serve at ncelectriccooperatives.com slash brighter. Wow, this new Coca-Cola Zero Sugar. Is it the best Coke ever? No! Yes! No! Yes! No! Yes! Okay, I'm gonna try it first. Yes! I need to try it first. Does your team mean the world to you? Then we're just alike. My team here at Hardison and Cochran means the world to me. And just like you, I have nothing but confidence in my team when it's on the line. If you've been injured at work and facing a blitz from the insurance company, I welcome you to call on me and my team. We have three workers' compensation experts ready to put in the game to protect you and your family. Hardison and Cochran, attorneys at law, here for you. 919 All Fours. Carolina Insider is presented by Wells Fargo. So Carolina in this three games in one week at home stretch defeated Virginia Tech on Monday night. Quick turnaround to see Boston College on Wednesday. It was not a terrific offensive performance for the Tar Heels. They made just 16 field goals, shot only 29.1%. That is the lowest field goal percentage in a win in Carolina history, but most importantly, a win. Let's see some highlights from that and hear from Puff Johnson after the game. Carolina and Boston College love high out on the right, kicks it in the left corner to black. He's going to try an early three and spin it in. Took both of them. Inbounds goes in the corner right to love. Clean look at the triple and he swishes it right home. Diagnoses his way to the left baseline, out to Black, shot clock down to five as he gets it back to Love, and he drops it in for three. Carolina the other way. Black kicks it in the corner, right Walton, feet set, three-pointer, yes sir. Karnick did a really nice job of protecting that basketball at the rim. So BC hanging around, it's 30-27. to 27. Manic looking for his first field goal, gets it for three. We'll give you some numbers on Baycott since that thumb has been taped against Miami here in a few. As Davis drives in, good screen by Baycott down low. Outweighs him by a significant amount, but nonetheless, a little bit of chatter. Davis to the cup, lays it in right side. Against Ashton Langford to Leaky Black on the right wing. Extra pass in the corner to Davis. Pump fake, gets Zachary by him. Then he elevates and drops in the three. Left sideline love. Jab step, drives baseline, gets right to the rim and lays it in. Gets it to Love. Can Carolina get some points? Love. Hard drive on the right. Gets the layup to go. Love's backed all the way to the timeline now. Shot clock is just at 14. Not much been going on. Love drives hard on the left. Floater no. Black put back. Yes. It wasn't pretty, but it's a win. 58-47 the final score. Tar Heels win by 11. Alongside a guy who brought a lot of energy in the second half, Puff Johnson. Puff, uh, third game back. How you feeling? 
I'm feeling great. Uh, the big thing I want to do as soon as I get in is just bring energy. Coach always talks about energy, effort, and toughness, and that's a big thing I feel like I can contribute, and that's uh, regardless if you're making or missing shots, I feel like uh, just no matter what, what can't change in your game is your energy, effort, and toughness on the offensive and defensive end. In a game like that where it's not real pretty and there's not a whole lot of shots going in for either side, how can you bring that, that energy, effort, and toughness that, that is a difference-making type of play? Um, the big thing that we always just preach about and Coach always tells us is a win is a win no matter what. So no matter what you have to do, you have to make enough plays to win the game. So if it's diving for a loose ball or grabbing offensive rebound, tipping it out, no matter uh, what you do, the biggest thing is you have to just make, it, make winning plays. Two games in the last 72 hours, what kind of physical toll does that take? It takes a big physical toll just because just getting ready for the game and being mentally prepared, it's something that uh, you're just extremely locked in. You use a lot of, you lose, you use a lot of energy, but um, yeah, two games, 72 hours. We knew this was going to come up, so it's not, uh, it's not surprising to us. And one thing that we always joked about in the locker room was like, it's just like we're back to AAU season because you play like two, three games in a day. So that's one thing that we had just to prepare ourselves for. Boston College had some good success driving and getting to the paint, 30 points in the paint for the Eagles. What needs to get better in that area prior to NC State coming to town on Saturday? Just like what, what I said before, energy, effort, and toughness and trying to keep your man in front. And if he does go by you, uh, just helps out on the back. That's what uh, we preach all the time. And so we just need to sharpen up on a couple of things and we'll be all right. It's been a long time for you getting back into the regular rhythm of being a part of things every single game. What's it, What was it like to have to wait for, for this moment? And now what's it like to finally be back and be contributing every single time out? It's great just uh, being back. Yeah, it took me 360 days after my last game was Wake Forest last year and just watching and trying to just understand the game and watch the game and just trying to develop my mental side of the game is just huge and I feel like it helped me a lot. Unwavering loyalty and commitment. That's what it means to be true blue. To earn this level of trust, Ford builds trucks that help you work smarter, tougher, to help you tackle any adventure year after year. See your Carolina Ford dealer today and discover what true blue means to you. Now get 0 for 60 plus 1,000 bonus cash on the 2021 Ford F-150. New inventory is arriving daily at your Carolina Ford dealer. Introducing 48 square centimeters of earning potential. Flawlessly designed. Undeniably versatile. Unlimited 2% cash back. This is the card built for real life. She's gonna be a drummer. Yeah, she is. That's gonna get loud. Right? The new Wells Fargo Active Cash Visa credit card. Unlimited 2% cash back on purchases. That's real life ready. Your life is more flexible and efficient than ever. And your energy is too. See how North Carolina's electric cooperatives are building a brighter future for the rural communities we serve at ncelectriccooperatives.com slash brighter. Wow, this new Coca-Cola Zero Sugar. Is it the best Coke ever? No! Yes! No! Yes! No! Yes! Okay, I'm going to try it first. Yes! I need to try it first. Does your team mean the world to you? Then we're just alike. My team here at Hardison & Cochran means the world to me. And just like you, I have nothing but confidence in my team when it's on the line. If you've been injured at work and facing a blitz from the insurance company, I welcome you to call on me and my team. We have three workers' compensation experts ready to put in the game to protect you and your family. Hardison & Cochran, attorneys at law, here for you. 919-ALL-FOURS. Try it first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your life is more flexible and efficient than ever. And your energy is too. See how North Carolina's electric cooperatives are building a brighter future for the rural communities we serve at ncelectriccooperatives.com slash brighter. Carolina Insider is presented by Wells Fargo. 
Well, Saturday in the Smith Center was a day to be a Tar Heel. If you didn't love that, hard to tell you what to love. Carolina plays one of its rivals, NC State, wins in dominant fashion, honors one of their all-time greats in Roy Williams, and honors an all-time great team in 1982. Let's see highlights from the win and some moments from those special ceremonies honoring Coach Williams and the 82 championship team as well. Have to slow it up as State did a good job getting back. R.J. Davis to Manic. Quick trigger three left sideline. Count it. Full court pressure from State. Carolina just able to get front side with one second to spare. Davis all the way to the baseline out to Love for three. Love straight away guarded by Helms. Helms knocks it away. Love recovers. He's going to pull for the long. Triple good. Drifts to the right sideline. Picks up his dribble. Crosses court left black. He'll try the three. That's good. Kicks it out to Davis. Shot clock down to eight. Davis with the much bigger Sebron on him. A long triple. He rainbowed it home. Love gets a Manic screen. Dumps it back to Manic. Top right triple. You know it. Black passes baseline right to Manic. Out to Puff Johnson. He'll try the three. Count it. And not to understate the fact that Baycott and, and oh. R.J. Davis are just coming. A long range three by Walton. Here comes Carolina the other way. Davis in transition, finds Manic open three, count it! And he did just what Baycott did there, tipped it and then grabbed it. Manic down low to Baycott, two-handed throwdown. He'll give it to Love, hustles front side, kicks it to Black, drives baseline, bounce pass, right corner, Davis, cash! I'll tell you, that inbounds pass that's gone to Baycott on a couple of occasions, and a steal. Caleb this time Love. by Love, right in front of us, Caleb stops, pops for three, yes! Holy cow! Timeout, NC State. Tarios have an open love on the left wing. He drives. Nice pass in the right corner. Three ball. Good. RJ Davis bangs it home. Hands off to Puff Johnson. Quick pass on the left side. It goes to Caleb Love. Nice little pocket pass to Baycott. The train rolls right down the lane for the Thunder. The lead is 25. As Love going to jack a three. Got it. Here comes Carolina. Manic had a steal. Styles jump stop, jump shot for two. There were so many special things around this game, but it really had to be punctuated with a good performance. And boy, did the Tar Heels deliver. North Carolina basketball is not about one person and definitely not about one coach. It's about the players and our teams. I hope in a few minutes you'll get to welcome our 81, 82 guys back because they put Coach Smith's first banner up there. And I hope in the second half you'll get even louder and cheer harder. Let's beat these guys in red a hell of a lot more. I'd like to thank my family. The two little ones here, they're going to be stars. Wanda, to say the least, Scott, our son. We didn't want him to come because the two boys had basketball games today. And there's no way I could live with myself if I made my grandson miss a game. So thanks to my family, my former players, and there's some of them up there today, some of them here today. I love you. Undoubtedly, this is one of the greatest teams in college basketball history. These Tar Heels finished the regular season with a 24-2 record and a share of the ACC regular season title. Carolina then topped number three Virginia to win a second consecutive ACC tournament championship. Then they loaded the plane and they headed for NCAA where they won three tournament games to advance to the final four in New Orleans. Following a semifinal win over Houston, the Tar Heels faced the mighty Georgetown in a showdown for the ages in a back and forth game that featured three future Naismith Hall of Famers James Worthy scored 28 points, and some guy named Michael Jordan gave the Tar Heels the lead for the jumper with 15 seconds remaining.
The Tar Heels won 63-62, earning coach Dean Smith his first national championship. Introducing 48 square centimeters of earning potential. Flawlessly designed, undeniably versatile, unlimited 2% cash back. This is the card built for real life. She's gonna be a drummer. Yeah, she is. That's gonna get loud. Right? The new Wells Fargo Active Cash Visa credit card. Unlimited 2% cash back on purchases. That's real life ready. Your life is more flexible and efficient than ever. And your energy is too. See how North Carolina's electric cooperatives are building a brighter future for the rural communities we serve at ncelectriccooperatives.com slash brighter. Unwavering loyalty and commitment. That's what it means to be true blue. To earn this level of trust, Ford builds trucks that help you work smarter, tougher, to help you tackle any adventure year after year. See your Carolina Ford dealer today and discover what True Blue means to you. Now get 0 for 60 plus 1,000 bonus cash on the 2021 Ford F-150. New inventory is arriving daily at your Carolina Ford dealer. I need to try it first. Yeah. Your life is more flexible and efficient than ever. And your energy is too. See how North Carolina's electric cooperatives are building a brighter future for the rural communities we serve at ncelectriccooperatives.com slash brighter. Wow, this new Coca-Cola Zero Sugar. Is it the best Coke ever? No! Yes! No! Yes! No! Yes! Okay, I'm gonna try it first. Yes! I need to try it first. Does your team mean the world to you? Then we're just alike. My team here at Hardison & Cochran means the world to me. And just like you, I have nothing but confidence in my team when it's on the line. If you've been injured at work and facing a blitz from the insurance company, I welcome you to call on me and my team. We have three workers' compensation experts ready to put in the game to protect you and your family. Hardison & Cochran, attorneys at law, here for you. 919 all fours. Carolina Insider is presented by Wells Fargo. A lot of sports getting going in at Chapel Hill as we move into the second semester and some big wins on the road for a couple of programs this week. Women's basketball goes to Cameron Indoor Stadium, wins at Duke for the first time since 2014. That was a 16 point win and the game really wasn't that close. Tar Heels led that one by more than 20 for a large portion of that contest. Wrestling went to Charlottesville, took on Virginia, and a narrow victory, the narrowest possible, just a one-point win for wrestling in that one. Let's see highlights of the victories. Carolina's really good in transition. Duke likes the up-tempo game as well, but Carolina also does a great job finding the gaps. Two teams have been playing really good defense of late, and it feels like this could maybe have a defensive flavor to it as they go inside for Usby. Off the left window, pretty move, and she'll have a chance for three. Well, that's just great execution, a beautiful screen. And they lead by three under 10 seconds to play in the opening quarter. Spinning in traffic, a kick out for Hodgson. Three ball on the right is good and a chance for four. Good shot on a drop. Got inside in on two defenders. Couldn't finish. Good post position. And then on the putback, it's blocked out of the hands of Akinbadi James. In transition now, Todd Williams able to score. Good child for Volker. Oh, a nice steal by Usby and a chance to run behind the defense to lay it in. Blue Devil's going to stay in the 2-3 zone. Good ball movement by Carolina and another three. Looking to drive, cut off, swings one outside for a Hodgson three, and they got another one. For right now, really struggling to score and letting Carolina have their way on the defensive end. One out of two for Goodchild, and Todd Williams buries one at the buzzer. Emblematic of this entire first half that was dominated by Courtney Banghart's squad. Long two, no. But an offensive rebound, a chance to reset. Littlefield going to launch it, hit a three. Usby on a drive. Kicks out for Hodgson, penetrates, kicks out for an Usby three, and that's a big bucket for the Tar Heels. At 12 in the first half, yet to score here in the second half. That's because Usby's doing a good bit of the damage, and now she's piled up 18 
I love how she keeps going, though. She's so physically and mentally tough. It's been a tough night for Mila Goodchild. Poole trying to find space inside. Somehow got it to go. <laughs> Nicely defended, though. Hodgson on a baseline drive. Inside it goes. Nice find to Poole. But North Carolina is going to take it on the road tonight and win in Cameron for the first time since 2014. So here's the thing. Sedano is not committing for that reason. Because he knew if he was going to commit, Keyshawn Clark was just going to wait. Of wrestling entertainment looking forward to it as we go back to action. 149 and some early fireworks from Sherman as he was able to catch Jared for clearing on his back for a moment. Look at that. Just like that. Blue. Sherman he just continues. Yeah, stick with him. And now Sherman is away. 40 seconds. Keating with the lead, but not for long. Nope, no points yet. O'Connor will get the two, and he grabs the advantage. Look at this. Look at this a shot, and look at the national champion with the single here. Going for it, the takedown. Now see if he's gonna tuck his head, chase, 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 and gets it. Now here we go. If he just want to drain the clock, he doesn't want to give up anything right here. At this point, another takedown. North Carolina 12, Virginia 6. Friday night duels from Mem Jim in Charlottesville. Oh, ho, 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 ho. look at that high C to a double. Oh, my, my. Look, make us a back points. We get a slice. Is. This is big. Just opened the matchup. We thought it was going to be tough, close. But Gavin Kane has opened it up. For the first time tonight, he has the Tar Heels in the position for bonus points. He'll add two more for good measure. He might, he almost tech fouled him. Yes, this, this could be a tech fall with the riding point. It's gonna be 15 points. He'll ride him out and a tech fall victory for Gavin Kane. Boy, some big names on the schedule for Carolina basketball this upcoming week. Tar Heels, a game that was originally scheduled for Monday, is now Tuesday, 8 o'clock at Louisville. Tar Heels will be on the road. Boy, they've played so well at home. See if they can carry that over to a big road matchup. Then the Heels back in the Smith Center. First of the two meetings with Duke comes up next Saturday evening. We'll have highlights of all of that and more next week on the Carolina Insider. Carolina Insider is presented by Wells Fargo, official sponsor of Carolina Athletics. And brought to you by Coke Zero Sugar, Coca-Cola with zero sugar and now even more delicious. Carolina Insider is produced by Go Heels Productions for Tar Heel Sports Properties, a property of Learfield.